What's going on guys? Welcome to Baruki. In today's video I want to talk about something I'm so passionate about and that is a new style of training. So previously I was having a sternum injury for about a year and I was doing weighted calisthenics and that really like hurted me in my sternum. So I had to, I had to switch to powerlifting and front lever training and although that is great I still miss the type of freedom you have with calisthenics so powerlifting you always need a gym you always need weights they're expensive it's always something that is bothering me and that is why i did an awesome research where i was looking for some type of training method that will get your body strong and it also gets you looking pretty good so uh, the only equipment that you're going to need in order to do these workouts is hang around my neck so that is amazing it's basically just a towel. So um, I was researching about this. I was really doing a lot of studies with different kind of people, different groups, and they all show very great results. And um, I want to introduce you to towel lifting. It's towel lifting, it's amazing. So in these workouts, in towel lifting, we're going to focus on six main lifts. And the first one is targeting the legs and we're going to do towel squats so because most people don't like doing legs we're going to do the towel squats as our first exercise so <clears throat> you take the towel about shoulder width or wider than shoulder width apart you really keep the tension in the towel so the towel cannot bend like this you really need it firm and strong and then you can choose between front squats or behind the neck back towel squats so um, I'm going to demonstrate them for you so you really keep the towel straight keep your um, keep your elbows tucked in and we're going to start with the towel squats okay obviously you want to see a side view and here it is so towel squats, make sure you engage your glutes, engage your quads, and here we go. One, two, three. Whew. Right, with the next exercise, we're going to target the triceps and the front delts. So it's called the towel overhead press or the overhead towel press, whatever you want to call it. So again, you're going to take the towel about shoulder width apart, so like this. Really going to tuck your elbows under, keep your lats tight. Um, also engage your glutes, core tight, and we're going to press upwards. So one, two, three, Ooh, four, five, Six, seven, eight. Whew. great exercise guys so um, the next one is one of the uh, most known most compound exercise of them all and that's going to work the posterior chain being hamstrings glutes lower back and also the upper back so I'm talking about the towel deadlift so as with regular powerlifting, you can choose between sumo or conventional towel deadlifts. So we're going to start with conventional deadlift. Towel deadlift, obviously. So here we're going to start from the top because there's no need to pick the towel up from the ground. So we're going to start from here, going nice and down. Really keep your lower back straight, as straight as possible to avoid injuries and also engage your hamstrings and your glutes. So let me show it from the side. Ah. 
and obviously you can also do sumo. You can go as wide as you want or as narrow as you want. I like to stand like this, really make sure that you're as tight as possible. And Okay, this one really works your, uh, your hamstrings, for sure. Now, everyone's favorite exercise that targets the chest muscles and also a bit of the triceps is going to be the, um, yeah, we're not going to use bench, but the towel bench press. So, it goes a little bit like this. So, you lay flat on your back. You want to uh, lift your feet up so you don't have too much of a leg drive. So, everything is targeted on the chest and we're going to keep the towel about as far as possible we're going to flare our elbows out we're going to press up again keep the towel as tight as possible to get the most out of this workout Man, I really feel my muscles working. So we almost did like a full body workout, but we're missing one type of muscle, and that is the biceps. So how are we going, how are we going to target the biceps? So we're going to take our towel like this, like wider than shoulder width, and we're going to, okay, keep attention. It's going to be very difficult. We're going to turn our wrists inwards, so you get like this. And from here, you can really do some nice bicep curls. Focus on squeezing the muscle. If you want to make it even harder, just turn your wrist in, so you have like a neutral grip. Let me show you from the side. If this one's too hard for you, you can always cheat a little bit. So use your... Um, your front delts. It's okay, we're just making a compound exercise out of it. Whew. Okay, um, last exercise because we want to get that real thick monster back. We're going to focus on towel rows. Towel rows. Let me pronounce this very clearly. So what you do, take a, again the, the same stance you're going to bend over a little bit keep your lower back as flat as possible and go to pull underneath your chest you can hold it at the top really squeeze the muscle it's all about squeezing the muscle and don't forget the eccentric is also very important You can also do it like a regular row. Okay, so there you have it, all your, your six main lifts. But now you're wondering, man, I'm an experienced lifter, I'm advanced, a towel won't do me very much. Well, I'm having something very special for you. So in order to increase the difficulty of this exercise, or these exercises, going to twist the towel like this and we're going to generate torque on the towel so the more you twist it the, the more difficult the exercise is going to be so now I've twisted it like this and how is that going to make the exercise harder well the towel wants to turn my arms outwards but I have to stabilize it in order to get my body straight so it's really working more of those small stabilizer muscles and you really get every fiber of, of all your muscles worked out so if i'm going to do a overhead towel press now it's going to be a lot more difficult I really have to put in the work in order to stabilize the muscles otherwise I would be like all over the place so it's a really great way to 
make your lifts advanced to really have progressive overload just count the amount of twists you make in a towel and it's going to have tremendous carryover also to power lifting and all of that good stuff thank you so much for watching guys if you have any questions leave them down in the comments down below don't forget to like comment share subscribe do whatever you have to do and please give this towel lifting a try it's a very great way to uh, get some muscle mass to really thicken out those muscles to get that horseshoe action yeah it's it's an overall great exercise um, selection so uh, hope you liked it I'll be seeing you all in the next video peace